The Clusty Crab, Bikini Bottom's premier daytime eatery, where it will be closing time right about now. Eight o'clock. So long, suckers. I've got a hot date with a little lady, and her name is Clarinet. Why? Are you open? Read the sign. I'll have a Krabby Patty Deluxe and a double chili kelp fries. No, you won't. I can't hang out here all night. I've got a life. Well, fine, if you don't want my money. Money? You mean, if we stayed open later, you'd give us your money? Sure. Mr. Squidward, welcome to the night shift. From now on, the Krusty Krab is open 24 hours a day. What? <laughs> We never have to stop working. Mr. Krabs. See you in the morning, boys. I can't hang out here all night. I got a life. Mr. Krabs. Isn't this great, Squidward? Just you and me together for hours and hours and hours, and then the sun will come up, and it'll be tomorrow, and we'll still be working. <gasps> it'll be just like a sleepover, only we'll be sweaty and covered with grease. Are you ready to rock, Squidward? No. Good, cause we've got customers! Here, please hit me as hard as you can. Psst, Squidward, I'm working in the kitchen. <laughs> At night. Don't hold back. Hey, Squidward, guess what? I'm chopping lettuce. At night. Look at me, I'm swapping the bathroom. At night. Ow! I burned my hand! At night. Night, 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 Will you please? Here, give me a moment's peace and take out the trash. All right. Taking out the trash. Taking out the trash at night. You mean outside? That's where the dumpster is, yes. I don't know, Squidward. It's kind of dark out there. But I thought you liked the night shift. You're right. For the Krusty Krab! Piece of cake. So you're not afraid? <laughs> nah. Well, I am. Especially after... Well... You know. What? What do I know? You don't remember? He was all over the news. Tell me, tell me. No, 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 I, I probably shouldn't. It would ruin the night shift for you. What happened? What happened? What happened? You mean you've never heard the story of the hash slinging slasher? The slash bringing hasher? The hash slinging slasher. The sash ringing, the trash singing, mash flinging, the flash springing, ringing, the, the cr crash dinging, the... Yes, the hash slinging slasher. But most people just call him the ha... <gasps> because that's all they have time to say before he... Gets out! <gasps> Tell me the story! Years ago, at this very restaurant, the hash slinging slasher used to be a fry cook, just like you. Only clumsier. <laughs> and then, one night, when he was cutting the patties, it happened. He forgot the secret sauce? No. He didn't wash his hands? No. Irregular portions? No! He cut off his own hand by mistake. You mean like this? Or like this? Or this? Or this? But what about this? Or this? Or this? Or this? Except or... he wasn't a sponge. So? So it didn't grow back! Oh, no! And he replaced his hand with a rusty spatula. And then he got hit by a bus. And
and at his funeral, they fired him. So now, every... What day is it? Tuesday. Tuesday night, his ghost returns to the crusty crab to wreak his horrible vengeance. Oh, but tonight's Tuesday night. Then he'll be coming. How will we know? There are three signs that signal the approach of the hash-slinging slasher. First, the lights will flicker on and off. Next... Dude, can I have some ketchup? Oh, here you go. Next, the phone will ring and there will be nobody there. And finally, the hash-slinging slasher arrives in the ghost of the bus that ran him over. Then he exits the bus and crosses the street without looking both ways because he's already dead. Then he taps on the window with his grisly spatula hand. No. He opens the door. <laughs> he slowly approaches the counter. 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 And you know what he does next? What? You really want to know? What? Are you sure you want to know? What? What? What does he do? He gets you. <laughs> SpongeBob. SpongeBob, I was. I was just. I was just. SpongeBob, I was joking! What? It's not true. None of it's true. It's not? Of course not. Nobody has a spatula for a hand. It was all a joke. Oh. Isn't this great, ah! Squidward? There's never time to wash the ceiling during the day. Uh, open 24 hours a day. What a stupid idea. Who wants a Krabby Patty at 3 in the morning? Oh, boy, 3 a.m. <laughs> Just look at this place. It's like a ghost town in here. Very funny, SpongeBob. What? And the lights will flicker on and off, just like the story. I get it. Hey, Squidward, how are you doing that without moving the switch? I'm not doing it. It must be the stupid, faulty wiring in here. This place isn't built to run 24 hours a day. What? What? Hello? 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 Nice try, Squidward. Nice try what? The phone will ring, and there'll be no one there. Oh, you crack me up. SpongeBob, I'm not doing this. Oh, oh, calm down, calm down. All right, what was it? There was the lights, and the phone, and the walls will ooze green slime. Oh, wait, they always do that. But what was that third thing? I didn't know the buses ran this late. They don't. Well, they're dropping someone off. <laughs> the sash ringing! The, the, the flash singing! The bash pinging! The hash slinging slasher! <laughs> At last you understand, we're doomed! No, that's not it. 
I am just so touched that you would go to the trouble to dress up as a ghostly fry cook and stand on the other side of the street just to entertain me. You must really like me. SpongeBob, there are two problems with your theory. One, I hate you. And two, how can that be me when I'm standing right here? No matter what I've said, I've always sort of liked you. Squidward, I use your clarinet to unclog my toilet. Huh? Get away, get away, get out of here, you're not welcome here! Can I have a job application? I brought my own spatula. I called earlier, but I hung up because I was nervous. Do you have references? Wait, if that was you on the phone and you on the bus, then who was flickering the lights? Nose for Ratu! <laughs> <laughs>